I am here at one of the uh, main uh, attractions here in the Golden Circle in uh, Iceland and uh, the place is called Geyser uh, Center and uh, the one behind me, the hot spring, the one that behind me, it basically boils water and sends, uh, sends uh, a column of water into the air uh, every uh, every uh, 10 minutes so let me uh, let me wait and uh, share with you what uh, what I will see it will be a beautiful beautiful uh, beautiful scene I just park here at the uh, geyser uh, geyser center and I think it's a free uh, free parking you see uh, it's a big uh, parking lot and I am on my way to see that uh, geyser so basically it's a hot spring that uh, boils uh, water and uh, sends water uh, into the air uh, every uh, 10 minutes so uh, so let's let's uh, let's go inside the uh, inside the center and uh, show you uh, share with you what I see and I, sh I want to uh, find out if the uh, if the parking is uh, free I just came from uh, Tingifler uh, National Park and I made a video uh, of that uh, you can watch it at that park I had to pay uh, for the parking and here uh, when I read the reviews online, uh, I did not see any uh, any indication that uh, that they charge uh, parking. So uh, here is the uh, here is the entrance, and I will have to wear a mask because uh, because they have a mask requirements now. And here I am inside. It looks like this is uh, a food court. I'm gonna. I'm gonna get a bite uh, to eat later, and uh, and there is a, a shop here. You can get uh, souvenirs and all that kind of stuff. Let me ask if those ladies. Uh, excuse me. Do you know if I have to pay for the parking or no? No, it doesn't need to pay for the parking. Yeah, okay. All right, no, uh, no, no, no parking fees, and uh, that's good to hear. And I'm not here to to shop, but I just want to uh, to see what they have inside. They have all that kind of stuff, you know. Uh, the sweater. This is the uh, this is the Icelandic uh, style. And let's go uh, let's go outside and uh, explore uh, the uh, geyser. I'm not sure how uh, how long it's gonna take me to uh, to walk. And there is uh, there is the uh, the, uh, the tour bus. See, uh, the tours are back now to business uh, after the uh, the vaccination program here in the uh, in Iceland is uh, going very well. So, uh, not a lot of uh, not a lot of COVID cases here. So, uh, so I, I you know if you visit Iceland, uh, you know you will feel uh, less. Uh, anxious and uh, apprehensive uh, you know because the cases are not that uh, not that uh, uh, they don't have big number of cases it looks like I have to uh, cross over the uh, the uh, cross over the street to get to the uh, to get to the geyser but there is uh, actually there is another restaurant here over there just be, just before I go to the geyser uh, hot spring I need to let me show you that one is another restaurant and that is the uh, geyser center and uh, and pretty much you can uh, park anywhere there and here I am uh, I'm just gonna cross over the street here 
to see uh, to see this uh, the hot spring and I heard that uh, it boils uh, it er interrupts uh, it uh, it uh, erupts uh, every uh, every 10 minutes and there are a few there are actually several hot springs uh, see as I am uh, as I am walking, I see. Uh, I, I can smell. Uh, I can smell. Smell the. Uh, the. Uh, you know the hot water, boiling, boiling and erupting from uh, underneath the ground. Yeah, it smells like uh, sulfur. As you can see off to the left you see there are a bunch of uh, a bunch of uh, hot springs and you can't uh, you can't walk beyond uh, this uh, this point over there you cannot actually go and uh, and uh, touch it for safety reason but what I'm gonna go now I want to go to the main one the main one uh, is the uh, the big one that is the one of the main attractions in the uh, golden circle so if you uh, if you're if you're gonna if you're gonna do the golden circle uh, um, this this is one of the uh, this is one of the main attractions earlier I was in uh, I was uh, I went to uh, think of Lear, uh, National Park and I made a very very long video so uh, I, I spent uh, there uh, about uh, almost three hours, you know. And I, every, every time I visit a place, I, I take my time. I'm not in. Uh, I don't rush, you know, because I'm not on a tour. Uh, so I am on my own, you know. I have uh, freedom to stay as long as I want, you know. I don't have anybody to rush me, and uh, and uh, this is the beauty of uh, going. Uh, going on uh, your own as opposed to uh, joining a tour and uh, wow boy so many people you know because this is not uh, this place is not uh, is not off the beaten path uh, it's a well-known place so uh, if you have time watch the uh, the thing of Lear uh, video that is uh, very long and here I can actually uh, do a shortcut. Looks, it seems like there is a shortcut here, or uh, or I can continue walking. But uh, let's uh, let's go this way. Yeah, let's go this way and uh, and see. Uh, the weather is cold, by the way. And uh, the reason why I, I uh, take my time. I spent almost three hours at uh, the uh, Thingiflir National Park because in the summer you have very very long uh, daylights, almost uh, almost 22 hours, you know. And the sun actually never goes down uh, completely, you know. That's in the summertime. That's the that's the good thing about visiting Iceland in the, in the summer. But if you visit Iceland in the in the winter, you're ma you're uh, you're gonna make a lot of trade-offs, you know, because uh, in the winter they only have uh, they only have uh, what uh, uh, three hours, four hours of sunlight, and there is a guy who's uh, who's uh, flying uh, a drone here, and I'm not sure if they allow uh, drones in this uh, area. I brought my uh, my drone all the way uh, with me. I carry it with me, but I haven't uh, uh, used it yet, and uh, I'm not even sure if I am allowed to to uh, to fly a drone. And here, a uh, bunch of uh, bunch of uh, people here waiting for the uh, waiting for the next. Uh, eruption you know it basically boils uh, water and it sends water all the way up uh, in the air every uh, every 10 minutes I believe so uh, 
Look, look, you see? Did you see it? That's uh, did you did you hear the sound? Wow, I, I it scared the hell out of me. I I actually jumped. Uh, I wasn't expecting that it would uh, erupt uh, erupt right now. I was I was uh, getting ready to uh, prepare for uh, taking photos, but uh, anyway, now now uh, if you want to uh, if I want to wait for the next uh, next one. I uh, have to wait 10 minutes, but I think I'm gonna wait here. I'm gonna I'm gonna spend the better part of uh, 10 minutes in this area just to uh, to set up my uh, my camera equipment and all that kind of stuff. And uh, it's really really nice, uh, beautiful uh, beautiful area. And I see people are uh, just they keep going that way. So maybe later I will uh, I will explore those uh, those. Uh, those hot springs, the other ones. <laughs> did you, uh, did you see? Did you see the, what happened? Amazing, amazing. Amazing. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna keep uh, going the other way and see what the what the other hot springs uh, look like. See, I'm walking I'm walking toward the uh, the other uh, hot springs, and uh, the one that you saw earlier is the main one. The main one that uh, becomes active every uh, every five to ten uh, minutes, I believe, and. Uh, And the whole area is uh, is full of uh, hot springs. Um, it's a uh, geothermal area. So before I head back to the restaurant to get uh, something to eat, uh, I need to show you what the uh, the rest uh, the rest uh, looks like. And I am uh, I'm almost getting there. You see another one. You see here. This is a small one. Wow. It's always interesting to see uh, something natural, uh, not uh, not uh, not man-made uh, hot springs, uh, so to speak. And uh, there is another big one up ahead. The whole area is full of uh, steam, and uh, and I can smell uh, sulfur everywhere. Right now is uh, almost three o'clock uh, afternoon, and I had uh, my breakfast around uh, seven thirty in the morning. <laughs> I had my breakfast around 7.30 in the morning, so it's time to to eat now. I will go check out the restaurant later uh, at the Geyser Center. Just uh, over there is the uh, another uh, another big one. It's, uh, it's another big one, and I see people. They keep uh, they hike all the way up, and I'm not sure if uh, if I should do that or not. Uh, I am uh, I'm just curious to uh, to see what uh, the view is like if I go up. But uh, there will be no shortage of. Uh, Beautiful views uh, along my uh, ring road, uh, ring road uh, um, trip, and uh, 
anyway folks I'm gonna go now uh, eat and uh, let me turn around the camera and uh, I will uh, I'll go eat and uh, and I will continue to uh, the next destination I think the next one is a, a famous waterfall so you will see it in the next video you know what uh, you know what I uh, I decided to just hike up all the way up to uh, to that uh, viewing platform all the way up and uh, I was kind of uh, hesitant about it and uh, and I wanted to go eat uh, and uh, and then I said you know what uh, before I leave this area let's let's go and uh, hike all the way up I don't want to miss something uh, something uh, beautiful you know so uh, I am already here why not just explore the whole area I came all the way from uh, Southern California you know so uh, let uh, let uh, what they what they say get your money worth you know and uh, as you uh, already know Iceland is very uh, very very uh, expensive you know so if you're gonna spend that much money why not just uh, why don't you just explore uh, every everything you see on your way you know don't skip anything and uh, that of course will depend on how much time you have and here as you can see I am walking on this trail very very muddy and uh, my uh, I have a uh, good hiking shoes uh, they are good uh, for this kind of uh, trails and uh, as I am going up and up to see the, the view gets gets better you see let's uh let's keep going see uh, what kind of trail I'm talking about so muddy and uh, and this is the uh, this is the the thing about uh, visiting Iceland, you know. Uh, just uh, prepare as much as you can when it comes to uh, your gears, you know, uh, hiking shoes, uh, you know, uh, jackets and waterproof uh, stuff, and all that kind of stuff, you know. And uh, I'm trying to be very, very conscientious of where I am, uh, where I am uh, stepping. I don't want to fall or slip and I am almost there I think the viewing platform uh, I just asked a lady earlier and she told me that there is a view of a beautiful farm on the other side and I asked her is it uh, is it really worth it to go up she said yeah why not you know and she's right why not you know I am already uh, I am already here so I am uh, filming it so uh, so that uh, you know it's to uh, if somebody asks me how was your uh, trip in Iceland I just tell them you know just go to my uh, I just send them the link to my uh, to my Iceland uh, playlist you know and I'm, uh, I'm sure it's gonna be a bunch of uh, videos uh, and uh, my videos uh, tend to be uh, a little bit uh, long uh, unlike the other videos uh, unlike the other videos uh, of Iceland the ones that you you see on uh, YouTube they don't share the whole thing you know and uh, this one this one will uh, will give you a better idea and it's not really good for my uh, for my channel to to, uh, to make the video very long because it uh, it's not good for the algorithm but that's not my uh, concern you know if the algorithm doesn't like me it's not uh, it's not a big deal and uh, all I want is just to uh, to be able to uh, to watch the video anytime I want and uh, relieve those relieve those moments of my life in uh, in this beautiful country called Iceland you know 
do I care if, uh, if people uh, don't watch the whole thing because it's a long video? Not really. And here you go. I got to the top. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. You already notice I am uh, breathing heavily because of the hike. It was a, uh, it was uh, quite a big. Uh, I would not say a big hike, but it's a little bit uh, demanding. And uh, what a beautiful, what a beautiful view, you see. So, uh, is it worth it? Absolutely, you know. And, and I am here, as you can see, not a lot of people around me, you see. And uh, not a lot of people around me, so uh, I can enjoy, I can enjoy the view from everywhere. And everywhere I look, it looks beautiful. Up, right, down, you know, everywhere, everywhere. And, uh, and you see there, up there, there is another uh, viewing platform and I don't really want to give up you know you know uh, I want to uh, I want to uh, keep going you know this is the uh, this is the interesting uh, part of uh, going to Iceland you know when you visit beautiful places you know you you kind of get uh, greedy it's like uh, it's like when you are in the stock market and you're really uh, making uh, good money and but you keep uh, you keep uh, you keep trading and you keep trading on the same stock even though you are really uh, making you made you really made uh, good money but you get greedy but you get the idea you get the analogy here in uh, Iceland you know you really uh, I already saw beautiful uh, views and I saw the main uh, the main attraction uh, at uh, geyser uh, center the main hot spring that most people go to but i don't want to i don't want to be uh i don't want to see that only and just go back to my car and uh, drive and keep going to my next destination i want to explore the room everything especially when the places are uh, off the beaten uh, path that's what when you get the more uh, more uh, peace and uh, tranquility you know the less people in the place the better you know uh, all right uh, all right yes look uh, look at the view off to the right you see and uh, so I got the uh, I got to the uh, to the end of uh, the trail uh, uh, to, uh, to the hiking trail and I see now two uh, two uh, uh, viewing platforms one on the left and one on the right and uh, depending on what kind of view you want to see that will uh, actually th these two platforms will cover uh, will cover both uh, views the view of the geothermal area is on this uh, is on the uh, right side and the view of the farm is on the left side so i will get back to the farm view in about a minute but first let me show you uh let me show you this uh it cannot get any better than this this is the uh, this is the highest uh, viewing platform that will cover uh, the geothermal area over here you see isn't it something so the uh, I'm gonna go to the other uh, uh, viewpoint and that is only a few uh, a few steps away and, uh, and that will give you the uh, the view of the farm in the back uh, so the one that you just saw earlier is the uh, the view of the geothermal uh, uh, area from above and uh, you see there is nobody here the reason why there is nobody here because the hike is a little bit uh, a little bit uh, demanding you know and uh, you look look at the uh, look at the view over there isn't it something folks let me turn around the camera you see uh, I uh, I hiked all the way here just to uh, avoid the uh, the crowd 
and this is the view the beauty of uh, of uh, this uh, of this uh, of the beaten uh, path uh, place that you don't see anybody uh, uh, around you if you hike to this uh, to this area and you can just spend uh, the better part of uh, what uh, 45 minutes just to relax and enjoy the, the tranquility and uh, the peace and uh, and I'm not sure about you uh, this is uh, really really good to, uh, for uh, mental health you know uh, this this uh, this uh, this kind of serene setting is really uh, really good for uh, for your uh, to clear uh, your head you know from uh, stress and from uh, you know and anxiety or whatever problem you're dealing with you need uh, to find a quiet place like uh, like the one I am uh, right now and I can tell you there is no shortage of uh, of places like uh, like uh, like the one you see behind me and you will see more and more uh, beautiful places as I go more to to those off the beaten path uh, places you know right now you see more uh, in my uh, the previous videos you see more people because uh, those places are close to Reykjavik you know uh, the capital and uh, the, the, when you uh, drive away from Reykjavik, you're away like five hours away, six hours away. That's when the that's when the fun parts uh, starts. You will you will uh, find more uh, quiet uh, and peaceful uh, areas, you know, just to relax and enjoy the the nature. So anyway, folks, I'm gonna go back now to uh, to the restaurant, the one that I showed you earlier. I'm gonna spend there like an hour. I will. Uh, have uh, something to eat and then uh, I'm gonna go to uh, to a, a beautiful waterfall uh, it's called Golfas if I'm not mistaken and uh, that will be in another uh, another video for now uh, have uh, have a wonderful day and uh, enjoy your day thank you for watching bye bye